In this issue of Aussie News tonight, the people of the world have a message for their governments. We will not give in without a fight. Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, how are you? Good. Thank you, my love. You're welcome. Good morning, friends. This is day two of our uh, occupation at Parliament. I just want you to look at Parliament grounds right now. There are dozens of tents all set up. Patriots have dug in and they're not leaving. So I know it looks like we are standing in traffic, but, but this if is, <laughs> this is a convoy that made it all the way to New Zealand's Parliament, where they yep. stopped and shut down the street right out front Parliament, so they could hear what we have to say. Yep, there are no cars in these things. We're doing it like Canada Ball. Everybody, and uh, here we are in the suite of uh, Craig Kelly. We have just been down the corridor to the uh, to the chamber where the Prime Minister, the Leader of the Opposition, and the Speaker reside. We were greeted at the entrance to that chamber by a security officer who was sent there to receive the letters. We were not allowed to go into uh, those offices and deliver them personally, but they have been received. They have been submitted, and now the seed has been planted and we're going to get out of here and get back over to our family. That's right. And the people are waiting at the front of Parliament to greet you. Yeah, they are. Oh, right. they are. Mission so accomplished. Mission, Mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. So yeah, until they read them demands out. And we're going to email those letters to the Prime Minister, to the Leader of the Opposition, and to the Speaker of the House. They're going to be emailed as well. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. So we planted the seed, and... Uh, Increased boots on the ground, rowing is going to fertilise and water that seed and hopefully it'll become a tree for us. Graham, what would you say to people kind of think, unsure about coming to Canberra at this stage? What do you think? Keep coming to Canberra. Saturday's mm -hmm. really important. That big paddock, the people's paddock out the front of the house, uh, house, I can't even call it a house, but that people's paddock, that has to be filled to overflowing because mm -hmm. that sends a vibrant message. 
And there's enough of us Aussies who have had enough of this, so let's get to Canberra. Yes. Come on down. Come and join us. Where you at? That day's a big day. It's your country too. Mm -hmm. Come fight for your country that you love. We absolutely love our country and this is why we're here. Are you happy with the outcome? Uh, with the delivery? Yeah. Yes, I am happy with the outcome because we are and we made sure it was delivered, yep. the, the, the letter that we drafted up. So um, we just got to wait and see what happens after that now. So the Prime yeah, Minister's so official on notice. We will, we will keep, you, keep, it, we will keep in contact and let people know what's going on. The yep. Prime Minister's on notice from the people yep. and now the ball's in his court to respond. Yes, it and is. if he doesn't respond, how would you uh, interpret that? We, the Australian people, will make a lot of noise. noise. And I'll tell you what, it'd be contemptuous for people not to uh, mm. respond to such a outpouring of emotion exactly. and have a look at all yeah. the great people and all these people out the front on that lawn. Yeah. They're here for a reason. Yeah, that's and, right. And if he thinks we're not fair dinkum, he wants to uh, be very, very mindful of the fact that uh, Canberra will become a parking lot on Budget Day. That's yeah. what will happen. Yeah, Budget Day, you know, we do, we do need to get back here on Budget Day because that's a big day for the Parliament. It's a big day for the Prime Minister and the Treasurer. And we need a massive rally here on, on Budget Day, which is March 29th. 29th of March. So we need to come back to Canberra in convoy again uh, for the, that week, uh, before and after the 29th of March, to celebrate a week here and make some more respectful and uh, compassionate noise for the people of Australia to save our kids. And leading into his election in May, that will be a... Uh a very foolish decision on his behalf not to, uh, not to, not to meet our demands because we're not going to stop. We are coming every uh, time there is a sitting day. And, uh, yeah, Canberra will be a parking lot and uh, not much will get done. Mm, may I say something? You, Australia, you planted the seeds. Yeah. You did this. Yeah. So well done, Australia. We the people. Mm. I hear for we the people. You no, turned no. up. You yep. turned up. That's all you had to do. You mm. just had to get off the couch and turn up. And I know, I know yeah. we don't want to be uh, political, but uh, it would be remiss of us not to thank Craig Kelly. Yes, thank you, Craig. Craig's, yeah. Craig's just humble yeah. in the background. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we never let their father The day's, on the the day's about these yeah. five guys. Yeah. Um, and so that's why I was happy to stand in the back and happy to ask mm. a question when the journalists came sort of thing. We are, are really fighting for the freedoms of this country. Simply want the mandates to end. Mm. Okay. We're ending around the rest of the world. The evidence, the science, the data is all on our side. Let's give Australians their jobs back. Can yeah. I say something? I'm not really a political person, but I'll tell you what, at the end of the day, Craig Kelly stood up for the people. Yeah, and that's what, I have, that's what I've got to say to the Australian people. He got us in here, you know. Yeah, yeah. And uh, so don't go branding everybody UAP and all this sort of rubbish. Mm, it doesn't that's matter. That's right. Yeah. You know, I had to wear a mask to get out into, into this place and out there to do what we had to do. And I'll tell you what, I don't care. I would wear a pink tutu to get in to do a work. <laughs> and imagine that look. <laughs> Only a he couldn't make that stuff up. He couldn't make this stuff up. Too yeah. bad a prayer to finish. Yeah. That might be a yeah. Oh, yeah. Can I pray? Yeah, please. Okay. Creator Spirit, Yahweh Yeshua, we just thank you. Allah, we just thank you for everything that you've done today and we just thank you for this man, Craig Kelly. Because he heard the call, and the people of Australia have heard the call, and we're all here together, unified, for the same cause, and for freedom and liberty in this country. So, Creator Spirit, we call upon you and all our ancestors to stand with us, and walk with us in unity, solidarity, in one mind, one accord, one spirit, and we thank you for everything this day. And I pray that them letters would end up in the hands of the right people by your spirit, Creator, and that justice will be served for the people of this country this day. Rama Bhagavan. Thank you, Creator Spirit. Amen. 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 Okay, I need to say one more thing. I'm not wearing my uniform shirt because it had, uh, it had demonstration paraphernalia on it. <laughs> so I had to get into a shirt. That was obviously one way too small for Craig Kelly. It's one of Craig Kelly's shirts, and it's obviously way too small for him because it fits me beautifully. <laughs> and seeing it's way too small for him, and seeing it's how it's so comfortable to wear, I think I'll probably keep it. I think it's mine as a memento. No. Is it? Really? Can yeah, I keep absolutely, it? Absolutely. It doesn't mean I'm going to vote for you. <laughs> 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 you can you both, you both, okay. I'm surprised it's not hanging off you like a big sort of sock clap. <laughs> <laughs>
Uh, Mary spirit, Kelly won our art today. Yeah. yeah, the spirit of Australia is alive and well. Let's rejoice in it. Yeah, the yeah. big families over there waiting for us all to come back. They've yeah. been in the heat all day. Let's get back to yeah, it. Yeah, Let's get back to our family. Yeah. Thank you. This is for Australia. Yeah. Let's keep it that way. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. Thanks, guys. We're all sovereignty. Yeah. Sovereignty. Thank you, viewers. And to conclude this episode, I would like to thank every one of you for your support. And remember, if you have any feel-good videos or pictures, please forward them on to me. Thank you, and good night.